Hello my beauties, until the end of April we will have one future spouse reading per day, okay? Uh, don't forget to check out my Tinder Wonders book and stock on it and join Tinder Wonders Club. There we're managing one monthly individual reading where I go live and answering your love questions. So here we go choosing a group. Group 1, future spouse savings savings those of you who have a bag right now and feel extra secure in life group two group two group two fruits of labor those of you who are working hard for these that's probably my group i love this tree so much and last one looking those of you who are searching for love intentionally doing some manifestations visualizations like whatever you do to attract your future spouse or love that's gonna be your group if you're not just sitting out there watching readings but you do actually something manifesting visualizing wishes map etc 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 we're gonna start with a savings card and let's see how rich your future husband is <laughs> because this question you know girls how rich your future spouse is spiritual work they reach in spirituality in terms of finances like they quite okay but nothing extra not millionaire billionaire type of but some somewhere average for some of you um even not average but this only indicates that you're gonna meet at young age and go go to work on your financial success together okay or maybe you as a person who already like from wealthy family and you're not that interested in finances you're more interested in spirituality in other person's soul okay so that's your answer you're gonna receive a spiritual husband let's see your love story extra tips five cards five cards here we go karmic relationship before you will meet them, you will explore some sort of karmic relationship in your life that will teach you how to love. And maybe after this, you will start paying attention. Yeah, coffin, there will be your transformation and this brings new beginnings. After this, you will start paying more attention towards spiritual rather than material. That's gonna be like be right before you will meet them, karmic relationships that gonna teach you a lesson. A heart and a key gonna come after you know and it's gonna be a blessing you're gonna feel like lord to each my like questions they they have the same answers that i have something like this the runner and here runner I, i'm channeling more like it, it gonna like you you're gonna develop really fast in your relationship and run towards one another like you, you're gonna make steps at mm, same time like you gonna make step he gonna make step and get closer 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 and let let's see what else for group three self-indulgence <laughs> self-indulgence focus on self self-worth self-appreciation yeah being in union with this person with your future spouse will transform your life and will help you to will help you to focus on yourself he will help you to pay more attention to yourself to understand he will help you to understand your self-worth and about the character very down to earth character your future spouse have like a very reliable very reliable guy even though like it's perfect balance of spiritual and material in him and knight of pentacles it's not the king yet as i said not extra wealthy but this person makes his own money so not luxurious like style but he will be able you know at least to pay for you in restaurant let me know how happy are you or maybe unhappy with your prediction group one and we move into the group number two let's see how rich your future spouse and you know, i adore this picture of this tree fruits of labor i adore those cards how rich your future spouse exhausted recharge and regroup okay uh, I'm seeing they're gonna be really hard working here at the, and at the moment that you will meet maybe retiring you know like maybe already the business will, will be making enough money for them to retire and, and experience this recharge and regroup yeah 
Let's see, let's see more. And loyalty, loyalty, they are extra loyal. Uh, they are very loyal person. Uh, so here we go, here we go. Five more cards on dynamic of your relationship, group two. Addiction, codependent, obsession here, like your future spouse gonna be to certain extent like controlling and obsessed with you. We have obsession, controlling, you know, and this control issues, by the way, uh, lead them to this exhaustion point at work, okay? Mm, okay. Controlling. Here we go. Heartbroken. Lord, what, what is it in your story? Deeply hurts, sad. Separation. Like, they will need to go through certain separations that may exhaust their resources here, like divorce or something, you know. When you leave in certain amount of your wealth behind, you know, like, and you need to regroup now after divorce. So we have this heartbroken energy. Breakup energy and the love. Yeah, most likely they gonna divorce for you or do something like this. Leave someone behind. Okay, here we go with the soulmates. Because they gonna feel that you are the soulmate. That you have certain like soul contract. And the hammer, sabotage, rebuilding. Again, rebuilding, regrouping, exhaustion. It may not work from attempt number one, a relationship between you and your future spouse. So uh, there will be stage of, of sabotage in relationship. But after this rebuilding, regroup stage, yeah, they're going to return to your life. Mo most likely, most likely group two. Yeah, sunglasses during this uh, period of time, watching, looking, stalking. They will be watching, like, and stalking you and focusing on you uh, during this uh, sabotage, uh, during this hammer stage of relationship. Let's see the character. The character. Again, five of cups, they will need to... They will need to leave behind certain relationships, certain third party, because this is third party to have these two of cups with you. And this loyalty during um, sabotage uh, stage, yeah, regroup, stalking you. And all this, this everything describes so well, so much in alignment. So let me know, girls who have chosen group two. Yeah, keep it arrow before, before pursuing you, yeah. Love is coming. Uh, now to the group number three with this magnificent eye. <laughs> Let's see how rich your future spouse is. Yeah, Group three, how rich? Independent. They are very independent and you should expect here. I don't want to make you sad, my beauty. Some sort of like 50-50 vibe <laughs> in the very beginning. Something will be about uh, your first date where you will be paying like for yourself and that's gonna get them sort of like I, I don't know with whom you will have this desire to pay for yourself and they will be wow like it's gonna get them it doesn't mean they're greedy and will not be paying for you but this something about 50 50 that's gonna impress them about you let's see stages of your relationship go talk you're gonna discuss them with your besties a lot this person like uh, because you're gonna receive sort of mixed feeling from them and you're gonna discuss paradise but every time like each your date gonna be mini adventure keep this in mind each and every your date it's like mini adventure and you will be so excited to tell your friends best friends you may even create a group chat somewhere in whatsapp and tell your besties look we have been there we went with him there you know and so many memories, sharing photos, and you're gonna be a very beautiful couple, by the way. And you may even set like avatars you together, even even just on stage being boyfriend, girlfriend here, yeah. And two more, two more, a handful of cards, and that's gonna be about this guy. He's gonna be very popular, whom you're gonna marry. And cassette again, a, a lot of memories. Could, he could be even social media influencer. Let's see last one card. Let's see what uh, last one card. His character, a, a little bit feminine, yeah, but but very very down to earth here. Very reliable same time, and under influence of his mom by the way here, his character like his mom's character. Okay, 